About 2,000 years ago, a Roman politician celebrated his victory by ordering a sundial and putting it on display for all to see, according to archaeologists who have just discovered the old timing device in Italy. It is incredible that the sundial and the inscriptions on it have survived intact for two millennia, especially because the city was sequestered for building materials during the medieval period. Students from the University of Cambridge found a sundial during the excavation of an amphitheatre in the Roman city of Interamna Lyranas, about 90 miles 144 kilometres southeast of Rome. The limestone sundial measures approximately 21 inches by 13 inches by 10 inches 54 by 35 by 25 centimetres, and has a bowl-shaped face engraved with 11 timelines, which mark 12 hours of daylight. Three curved lines intersect perpendicularly with these lines of the hour, marking when the winter solstice, the equinox and the summer solstices should occur. The iron needle of the sundial casting shadows, known as gnomon, is missing, but its lead base is still there, the researchers noted. This type of bowl-shaped sundial is known as a miscleum, and was common during the Roman period.